Malta Massey, bringing you the latest happenings in dancehall and reggae music. Welcome, it's Malta Massey, and here are the stories making the cut for today. Shano and Ragin King blast vloggers. Aishana gets backlash after baby comments. Jamaican comedian receives death threats over skit. Bounty wants a Jamaican walk of fame. Stay tuned for the stories in detail. <laughs> walk one, walk one, walk one, Malta Massive. <laughs> yes, me there, me there, me there. I hope everybody all right. I hope everybody day is going great so far. So yes, so I guess I don't know by now. So Shano and Ragin King, you know them, them address the vloggers. But for Shano, I have a question, right? I have a question, and this is a serious question. Shano, is it that? vloggers are now your personal PR people like seriously every single thing where you do it's our obligation if you come down with Chanel and talk about it every single thing that you do that's my question right we're supposed to take you and put you up on pedestal and just address every single thing that you do that's my question for Ragin King no. I understand say certain vloggers, you know, they use misleading titles or whatever. I mean, I can't do that. Motomacy is not for the misleading titles. If the artist them not say one thing or do one thing, don't say them do it. All right? But if it is that, it is in your life where you did something negative or said something negative and the vloggers them highlight it and give them interpretation of what you mean, is that so bad? Well, I guess for your end it is bad because I never that you mean. But you have to understand that people interpret things differently. Even if you say it blatantly, they still are gonna misinterpret what you mean. Alright? So nobody go out there and send death threats or whatever. Yes, you're probably bad, you come from a base. You know them love talk about them Manticonian and them bad self and Spanish town and badness and everywhere badness, badness. Everybody bad, right, Jane? You just take the opportunity to draw it out. As a matter of fact, several vloggers address this issue and they raise valid points. One of the points that they raise is why is it when them do stories found or whatever? You know, go on no Instagram page, you know, and big them up and say, Ray Tay Tay, big up on yourself because you know highlight this and bring this to the fore for me and I represent me and re 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 and I like them videos when they put it up and I leave comments and I need it or whatever but I only see them one always I come criticize why the relationship can be mutually beneficial that's my question if the vloggers them are publicized on the thing because remember you know no publicity is bad publicity even if them come cause state their own opinion is still a given publicity so why is it uno can't come on and give us roses give us roses when we deserve it instead of send with death threats and i criticize when i talk and i talk be about things right uno need me for you know spies uno need me for you telling us if it's talking about her but i'm not gonna do that me just really hope going forward you know the vloggers and the entertainers can live in harmony is that too hard is that too hard for us to do i don't think so i don't think so at all people let me know anything in that comment section when you can view the video um Raijin king put up and shay no right now then leave in the comments remember me said the blogger boy or the blogger girl suck your ma and a screen record my life and put you out and put no bad remarks because so on the state you don't like pick out the good news you don't like pick out the bad news I'm holding on you see feel like me and no chuckings slap one on the face blogger boy blogger girl hear me I say no you saw me I try to show my people me and Black Rhino do a good song called Somebody Pitney all the way somebody Pitney you see me yeah you might have one shoes your arm 
pit probably stink or your teeth one brush or you probably not have a toothbrush or the toothpaste to do it because some people you get to me I say yeah no so watch you now the vlogger them all know me not see no vlogger say yo bomba this is a good song this you know yeah man I'm gonna review this no but if you see fuck you're not ready for review that's why you say right now but you know what they're phone and look a style at you know and you know why I did that video I pre me I pre back the comments and the people must say some waste man blogger I'll know our vlogger I won't want them I'll know no review them song yes so say yes people pre the video from Aishana we've been not wearing for the Christmas says Baby, now nah, we're for you. You know, like how them say all time things come back in again. Like, you know, we used to wear flip ear style back in the days, and then at one point it come back in. And plaid used to wear back then, and then it come back in. Maybe by next year, baby wearings come back in. But right now, now nah, we're. Good body, I wear. Lace front are wear. What else are wear? Bag of things are wear for Christmas, but not baby. Mmm. I don't know about the next girl, but baby now wear for me right now. Next year, probably we'll come back and start. So yes, she deleted the post off Instagram because it stir up a lot of bad comments. I mean... To me, Aishana can't say baby now wear because Aishana, you have your son and probably you don't want any more children. So it's okay for you to say baby now wear and material things are wear like lace front and all of these things, material things. Some people are more sentimental than that, Aishana. Some people place value in, you know, their offspring and that because you probably don't want any more that means they have to comment about baby now here. You know how much woman out there right now go fertility clinic? You know how much woman out there right now want a baby? So even if at Christmas day they find out, they might be overjoyed. Right? Come on, Aishana. Sometimes yeah, you just talk, but sometimes you have to think about what you're saying because you're a public figure and all, and people watch your thing, yeah, and you offend many people. And artists of all people, on easily but hurt if anybody especially the vloggers talk out something about on the feel so hurt about it so why not bear other people feelings in mind that's all i have to say about that yes so this comedian his name is Voldemort. Voldemort. in he did a skit preach Hey guys, what's up? I'm your boy for the morning today. I will be showing you how to flip cash. I've been seeing all these sites, these pages telling you how to flip cash, but today what I'm gonna show you is extremely legitimate and guaranteed. So, whether you have silvers or whether you have paper money, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna show you about how to flip cash. Okay, so first, as you can see, it's on heads, okay? Look, it's real. Tail. That's how you flip a silver cash, okay? Now, for the paper money. See that? That's how you flip cash. Much you got of it, okay? So, don't let this guy take your money, okay? Before that, give it to me. Yes, yeah, so apparently my kid. Dead tricks. Um, one of them say, Pussy, anyway, in the street, man, all you, you got dead. Pussy, suck your mother a hundred times. Let me even call the youth, where's boy for that skit there? But me, me miss it. Me not get it. Me not get, me not get the anger. Me not, me not, me not, me not get it. Somebody want to explain it to me in the comment section, please, and thanks. Why is, why, why, why are viewers so upset? about this little skateboard flip money is it that it's the new hustle in the street are the new hustle that and the boy a highlight on a little thing so on a mad at him is is that is, is that's what's going on i mean i know somebody please tell me anyways bounty killer raise a valid point in at this instagram post you know it's a snoop dog getting star and the walk of fame and bounty said 
why the government of Jamaica. Let me read it exactly what he said. This is what Jamaican governments fail to do, recognize their own, where is the Jamaica walk of fame. Not a bad idea in a bounty. Not a bad idea at all. Not a bad idea at all. Jamaica have so many famous people, so many trendsetters. Why is it the government, even the private sector, somebody, why, why aren't they being acknowledged? Like seriously, why they can't get a star? Why we can't create a big deal about it too? Me I wonder, mother, me I wonder. But I love if we have one walk of fame bounty. I would love that. Anyways, Bounty will be previewing his music video on Tropics, Big Up Tropics, um, on Friday, November 23rd. 23rd. Um, in the it upon a bone story thing. I think Pampote in the you look like Pampote. Yes. Pampote in the Mr. Danny Boo. Mmm. Yes, people, stay tuned for that video. Anyways, people, I'm out of my city, you know, I say a crazy love my half of my viewers, crazy love my half of my subscribers. Yeah, I'm going to bless up on the self, I'm going to big up on the self. Enough love, enough respect. I'm out of my city. I'm gone. Mouta Massey. Mouta Massey. Covering the latest in Jamaican music and culture. Like. Share, comment, and subscribe now. now. now.